Hi everyone, welcome to the channel Learn and Heal. Today we are discussing the chapter Matter Around Us, the third lecture of the chapter. So uh, last two lectures we discussed panito. Earlier we have discussed about the mixtures, compounds, elements, everything, and mixtures. I have separate panam na rakardo. Namma discuss panito. Now this is the last lecture of the chapter. Matter around us. Ninth class la matter around us is the chapter we are talking right now. Okay. Now in the chapter la romba important ana oru part we are going to cover. So we are going to discuss about type of solutions. So here about the solutions we are discussing today. We'll be seeing about the true solution. We'll be talking about colloids. We'll be talking about suspensions. Okay. We'll be seeing in detail one by one. We'll start. So first question. Yeah, obviously this will be the first question. What is solution? Solution na na. Namal kitheriyum solution na ipo me. Okay, liquid er kerda. Adu kulle do sugar pota solution na theriyum. And the marilla namal kitheriyum. Actually, what is the definition of solution? Adu paathar la. A solution is a homogeneous mixture of two or more substances. What is that? It is a homogeneous mixture. Homogeneous mixture na, ama component composition will be uniform throughout. That is a homogeneous, homogeneous mixture. Component composition will be uniform throughout. You cannot see the particle separately. Particle cannot be seen separately. So simple definition. This is a simple definition of solution. A solution is a homogeneous mixture of two or more substances. Yes. We'll see what is a solution. As we said, it is a mixture of two or more substances. Adala, you will have solute and solvent. You will have solute as well as solvent. Solute is a solute is a minor component, and solvent is a major component. So the solution is the a little bit. Konjanda namluk solute irukum, solvent vandu nare irukum. So ipo nama lime water pourre, ilena sugar solution prepare pannre. Nam conjunctana sugar pudwe, nare tani ruku, ama the same thing. Conjun salt, nare water. So salt is the solute and water is the solvent. So solution gula, who will be there? Solute and solvent. Solute is a minor quantity and solvent is a major quantity. Either random same the solution. About the solute yar is salt. See, salt. NaCl is a solute and water is a solvent. So, randomly mix solute and solvent mixing, you will be getting solutions, a homogeneous mixture, salt solution. Salt solution is solvent water, solute on the NaCl. This is the basic idea. Then, we are going to discuss about these three types of solution in this lecture. True solution, colloidal solution and suspension. How we are classifying this? We are classifying it based on the Particle size of the solute. Solute or a particle size compare panida nama in the type of solution moon up. So we'll see the differences. Right. See, first one the particle size in the Arabic law. Particle size on the rumba small iron the china. Actually, in the solution on the actually true solution. Okay. This is true solution. This is colloidal solution, and the other one is suspension. Now we are talking about. Particle size, first point, particle size. Particle size on the true solution is less than one nanometer. It is very, very small. And if it is for colloidal solution, the particle size will be ranging from one to 100 nanometer. And a 100 nanometer than each in a particle size is greater than 100 nanometer, then you can say that it is a suspension so based upon particle size we can classify so if the particle size is very small one nanometer abdina ama the true solution da illa 100 nanometer vada adhigam abdina adu suspension da illa 1 ku 100 ku in between da abdina that is a colloidal solution separate panna mudiyuma nama filtration separation ellam paathidola ama idu eppadi separate panna mudiyuma filtration moolama pannikalam yara pannikalam suspension Filtration maniglam, but colloidal solution and true solution yo, namlala filtration panna mudiyad. Okay. The third point is settling of particles. Particles settle down aguma. Yes, suspension le particle will settle down. 
then colloidal solution particles settle down epo centrifugation pannum bodu centrifugation nabo irukkula ama yes nama or centrifugal vechittu high speed la rotate pannuven due to centrifugal force appo enna agum test tube dhaan irukum test tube la nammalo solution irukum adhu centrifugal poduve adana and the centrifuge vandu adukapram romba high speed la vandu rotate pannuven adukapram nee paathutena solution la vandu keela solid particle irukum mele liquid irukum nee separate pannikalam so abbi colloid solution ah nee centrifugation pannitena aama this solid particle will settle down but true solution la it will not settle particle will not settle then appear appearance abbi irukum nu solranga suspension is opaque opaque na opaque na it's not transparent not transparent transparent kediyadu we can we cannot see through புரியுதா ஒபேக் அண்ட் தி அதர் ஒன் கலாய்டல் சொல்யூஷனஸ் செமி ட்ரான்ஸ்பேரண்ட்னு சொல்லிக்கலாம் சொல்யூஷனஸ் ட்ரான்ஸ்பேரண்ட் we can see through then fifth one scattering of light whether anyone scatter light see suspension do not penetrate uh, like light on the penetrate ay aga maten in the suspension colloidal solution le it light will scatter and true solution le light does not scatter then sixth one diffusion of particle diffusion nadakuma sir diffusion na enna what is diffusion simple yeah it is a mixing of substances how due to the movement of particle particle oda movement ullil irukkira particles oda movement nale substance on the mix aichina we can say that it is diffusion so diffusion is nothing but the mixing of substance due to the movement of particle so su suspension suspension do not diffuse colloidal solution diffuse very slowly but true solution rapidly bayangarama diffuse aagum okayla diffuse aagum yaar true solution then brownian movement sir brownian movement na padipen we will be studying that don't worry about that so now you just remember this one we will be studying about the brownian movement suspension may show colloidal solution kandipa it shows the brownian movement true solution no it won't show the brownian movement and the nature the last point but not the least yeah so nature patena look at that true solution is only homogeneous mixture nama definition so nella solution solution is a homogeneous mixture of two or more substances and the solution actually the basic definition is another it's about the true solution solution na eppadi irukano solution na homogeneous a irukano puriyada so solution is homogeneous true solution is a homogeneous mixture that is components mix completely throughout uniforma mix pannuven okayla so colloidal solution and uh, suspension is heterogeneous very very important புரியுத நேச்சர் பார்த்தேன்னா ட்ரூ சொல்யூஷன் ஹாமோஜினஸா இருக்கும் பட் கொலாய் சொல்யூஷனும் சஸ்பென்ஷனும் ஹெட்ரோஜினஸா இருக்கும் ஸோ திஸ் இஸ் திஃபரன்ஸ் பிட்வீன் டைப்ஸ் ஆஃப் சொல்யூஷன் திஸ் இஸ் வெரி இம்பார்ட்டன்ட் ஸோ யூ வில் பி கெட்டிங் தி ஐடியா அபவுட் வாட் இஸ் த டிஃபரன்ஸ் பிட்வீன் ஆல் த்ரீ ஓகே நவ் கொலாய்டல் சொல்யூஷனை பத்தி வில் பி டிஸ்கஸிங் ட்ரூ சொல்யூஷனை பத்தி வி டோன்ட் ஹாவ் டு டிஸ்கஸ் எனி திங் தி சுகர் சொல்யூஷன் சால்ட் சொல்யூஷன் இல்லையா கம்பௌண்ட் கம்ப்ளீட்டா திஸ் ஆஸ் யூனிஃபார்மா என்ன சொல்ற கம்போனன் கம்ப்ளீட்டா தட் இஸ் யூனிஃபார்ம்லி காம்போசிஷன் யூனிஃபார்மா இருக்கும் அவ்வளவுதான் யூனிஃபார்ம்லி காம்போசிஷன் யூனிஃபார்மா இருக்குமா வாட் ஆப்பன் யா ட்ரூ சொல்யூஷன்னா கம்போனன்ஸ் வில் மிக்ஸ் கம்ப்ளீட்லி த்ரூ ஆவ் தி சொல்யூஷன் ஸோ காம்போசிஷன் வந்து யூனிஃபார்மா இருக்கும் தட் இஸ் வாட் இஸ் ட்ரூ சொல்யூஷன் சுகர் சொல்யூஷன் சால்ட் சொல்யூஷன் எவர் திங் இஸ் அன் எக்ஸாம்பிள் நவ் கலாயல் சொல்யூஷன் colloidal solution is a heterogeneous system yes we have discussed about that heterogeneous system it consists of dispersed phase and dispersion medium colloidal solution la nama solute solvent ku badala we are going to use dispersion phase and dispersion medium dispersion phase na you can say that it is like solute kind of thing and dispersion medium na nammalku enna solliralam solvent nu solliralam so solute solvent ku badala in the colloidal solution la nama use panna porudhu this is it yeah dispersed phase and dispersed medium so dispersed phase or dispersion medium as solid agala liquid agala gas agala it doesn't matter so the combination of gas in gas 
So colloidal solution is the combination of possible. All combinations are possible except gas in gas. That is solute, dispersed phase gas, dispersion medium gas, and the matter condition is not possible. So dispersed phase and dispersion medium gas that is not a colloidal solution. That is a true solution. About Adilama, I'm like eight combinations sub possible. So, on the eight combination, you can see here on the table. So, dispersed phases, I told you it is solute, dispersion medium is solvent. So, the name solid and solid, solid, soul and solve. Other alloy, gems, colored glasses, solid in liquid, that is paint, ink, egg white, everything, solid in gas. Solid in gas is C, solid in gas in a mana solve, aerosol in solve, Purida. Then liquid in solid, that is gel, liquid solid, that is gel, curd, cheese, jelly, and solilla. Then liquid and liquid, important emulsion. Then uh, milk, butter, oil, etc. Liquid in gas, again aerosol, mist, fog, cloud. So gas in solid. Solid foam, cake, bread, etc. Gas in liquid foam, soap, lather, aerated water, soft drinks, soda bottle. Soda bottle is liquid water. Water is dissolved in carbon dioxide. But the thing is that we have a soda bottle open and bubbles. We have a bubbles. We have a soda bottle in high pressure. High pressure in amena panirukum, carbon dioxide gas and the water will dissolve panirukum. So, gas, carbon dioxide is dissolved in liquid water. So, that is the aerated rings. That is open panumbu then now the pressure come yago. Lia, ni open panumbu. Open panumbu then the dissolve irigra, carbon dioxide gases will be liver. That is the bubble cell and amala, pakamudi. Okay, ingla. This uh, eight combinations you have to study. And gas and gas is a true solution that you already know. So this table with the examples, you should remember. Okay. Yeah. We'll move to the next part. Now we'll be talking about the Brownian movement. Brownian movement, we have seen that Brownian movement is shown by colloidal particle. So when this colloidal solution, we are viewed under a powerful microscope. It can be seen that the colloidal particles are moving constantly and rapidly in a zigzag direction. So, in the colloidal solution, that is, particle size 1 nanometer, 100 nanometer, in between the colloidal solution, you are seeing that through the microscope. Microscope, is you are can able to see the particles are moving. Every move is zigzag direction, constantly they are moving with a high speed. So, the speed is zigzag direction. You take some pollen grains and put it in a, uh, water. So, water is pollen grain. You can able to see the movement. Zigzag is constant. In a particular direction, randomly, rapidly, they are moving like this a straight line. I, I will show you the picture. See, this is how it will move. It will be moving constantly and rapidly. And this is the motion, zigzag, zigzag movement will be possible. The Brownian movement of collided particles due to unbalanced bombardment of the particles by the molecule of the dispersion medium. Dispersion medium is solvent. So solvent molecule, we solute molecule, collide in the bombardment, this movement is possible. So the Brownian movement is a zigzag movement of the colloidal particle. We can see that when you are showing it in a microscope. Yes, microscope. This is moving because it is colliding with solvent particle. So now the movement is possible. Now we'll be going to another one that is Tyndall effect. When a strong beam of light is focused on a colloidal solution, the path of the beam is visible. This is known as Tyndall effect. Tyndall effect is again a phenomenon with respect to the colloidal solution. If a colloidal solution learn a light pass panre. So light pass panode, the path of the light will become visible. And the light to the path number. And the effect of the Tyndall effect. And the path and the number of the path and the path and the Tyndall 
icon see the example you can see that headlight headlight lend vera light illengla car oda headlight lend vera light this light is we can able to see the path look at that the path is visible path of this light is visible this is tindal effect this is due to tindal effect and of course the blue color of the sky that is also due to tindal effect just remember that one but remember this phenomena the tindal effect is not observed in case of true solution tindal effect is not observed in true solution we can see that look at that when a laser beam you are passing through pure water pure water pure water there is no path we can able to see but the same light you are passing through a colloidal solution you can clearly see the path you can clearly see the path so this is what they are telling uh, when a when light is passed through colloidal solution you can able to see the path of the light this effect is what you are calling as tindal effect and this path of the light is what you are calling as tindal cone so true solution layer that is not visible and we'll be talking about the other condition liquid and liquid so nalle emulsion so this is the last topic of this chapter emulsion another emulsion again it is a colloid eight types of colloid lo nu paatha da liquid and liquid okay milk ela adoda example da okay liquid and liquid is a colloid of two or more immiscible liquids where one liquid is dispersed in another liquid liquid and liquid da that is fine emulsion is liquid and liquid but what is the peculiarity of that liquid and liquid these both are immiscible liquids immiscible liquid na they will not mix each other so immiscible liquid dot a combination the emulsion this means that one type of liquid particle gets scattered in another liquid in simple words emulsion another solitana you can uh, tell like this emulsion is a special type of mixture made by combining two liquids that normally don't mix normally mix agada and the liquids and combine panitena you can say that this mixture is what we are calling as emulsion hello da and examples milk butter cream egg yolks paints cup syrup everything we can say these are the examples of emulsion ipo inge vandu nam enna pandrena or liquid mixture emulsion a maatradhukku nam enna solluva emulsification nu solluva the process that process of turning a liquid mixture into emulsion is called emulsification emulsion actually one the two types of emulsion are there so one is oil in water emulsion so here oil is the dispersed phase and water is the dispersion medium so solute is oil and solvent is water nu solikalam so dispersed phase is oil dispersion medium is water oil in water is one type the example is cream cream is oil in water now the next one next one what will be the other type water in oil now the dispersed phase is water dispersion medium is oil it is changed water dispersed in oil so the example you can say the butter so there are two types of emulsion oil in water water in oil so cream is an example of oil in water butter is an example of water in oil then what are the application emulsions find a wide application in food processing pharmaceuticals metallurgy metallurgy and other it is nothing but the process of extraction of metals process of extraction of metals extraction of metals we'll be studying about that is in the later uh, higher classes okay detail we will be studying about metallurgy it is a process of extraction of metals so these are the application of emulsion so we have completed this chapter matter around us so we have discussed about all the things in this chapter so rand uh, videos erkanave pannirukom this is the third lecture so moon lecture we have completed the chapter matter around us so that is it for the session keep watching thank you thank you very much